Hi guys, Rockets here, back with another video of five games with commentary. Today we're just having a bit of fun, we're playing a meme deck, we're playing a nod deck with six War Factory units. Now hear me out, I would never recommend anyone play this seriously on ladder, um, however a nod War Factory units are quite strong, quite diverse, and there are definitely worse decks out there. I've had a lot of fun uh, so far playing this deck. So if you are bored or you know you just want to try something different, this is good for a bit of fun. But again, I would never play this seriously on ladder. Okay, I'll just uh, show you what the units are. Uh, okay, so it's wheels, bikes, chem buggy, scorpion, uh, Giga Cannon and Stealth Tank. Now we're being laser drone rushed, so we are going to have to counter with bikes. Okay, so this is bad um, because we're we're on the back foot a bit here. Uh, this deck does struggle against laser drones because they're cheap. Um, they're cheap, so we struggle early on against them, and our best sort of defense is bikes. We've got a harvester now, so we need to outplay him with our bikes, really. Uh, if he works out that he can just keep spamming laser drones, we are going to be in trouble. So what I think I'm going to try and do here is potentially Giga rush him, sorry not Giga rush him but base him with our Giga cannon, get over here. Okay all of our bikes are down to one model now, this is really sad. Okay, I just basically melt, melted our Giga. We, we might just have to win this the old fashioned way then. I mean, he's got the idea to, the, the right idea of, um, boosting his drones because they are going to die to one bike shot whatever happens so he might as well have them fully charged but yeah we just if he just kept on spamming laser drones uh he would have won that but because he wanted to go double half he lost that game for himself okay so that's one nil uh we're one up at the minute played one 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 so yeah, that was good. Our deck does struggle against things that are strong against War Factory, obviously. Uh, so things like Laser Drones, Mutant Marauders, Grenadiers, MLRS, Giga Cannon, that sort of thing. You get the idea. Establishing battlefield control. Okay, start charging straight away. Okay, so he's gone War Factory. Buggy, so we'll get some bikes. Try and get him to shoot our wheels. That uh, saves our bikes. Try and get a two on one against his bikes. Okay, we are just going to keep spamming bikes here. Okay, I'm, I'm probably shooting 
probably doing this wrong by shooting the same bike squad too many times. He's decided to go double harvester, which is fine by us. We are just going to attack him. We're probably going to uh, giga cannon him after this. Okay, move up everything. And we're going to get his base. Okay, that's fully charged now. And there goes his base. Great. Uh, the reason I went Giga Cannon there is because he went double harvester, so there was going to be a delay in him uh, producing more units, and we needed to try and dispatch him before he could get any tech units out. Because he could have a tech unit that could absolutely crush everything in War Factory. So that's two. Uh, we're 2 0 at the minute. Okay, wheels to the pads. Right, he's built barracks. If he is rushing me with missiles, that's not too bad. Okay, I could have built a chem buggy there. I'm going to step off when he steps on. Right, and now we're going to get a scorpion for his bikes. Okay, that's good. We're going to get a giga cannon to the middle pad here. It's going to be a bit dodgy. Gonna boost it. We just need to get more units around it, so uh, it's protected. Okay, they got banshee, so that sucks. Okay, so. See, just seeing what this guy's got in his deck, we're probably going to have to give up on the Giga idea. Okay, so we need bikes and chem buggy at the minute. I shouldn't have let him get on at the top. Alright, got him. Okay, so that's three. We're three oh at the minute. So, going good. Establishing battlefield control. Right, so wheels to the pad. Uh, he's got a low level base, which makes me want to giga cannon it. Uh, it's worth paying attention to that sort of thing. If you've got any unit, I've got a unit that can uh, do good damage to your opponent's base. It's 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 worthwhile keeping that as like a viable option. Not too concerned about him going up there. I'll get a chem buggy uh, in a second. There we go. Right, 
Right, so he's gone second. Well, no, that was the, actually his first harvester, I believe. Right. I wanna I wanna gigger him. So we're we're slowly gonna advance with our giga. Get a chem buggy up here. Okay, got him. Awesome. So that's 4 0, I believe. <clears throat> so this will be our fifth and final game. Uh, <clears throat> going well so far i enjoy uh busting people's bases with giga so we've managed to do that a couple of times uh wheels to this pad here start charging straight away this guy's got a level 13 base and this is not an ideal map for uh basing someone with a giga so probably won't happen this time right try and get him to shoot our wheels. Okay, we want to push him back as far as we can with MLRS, but when he's got an MLRS, because uh, that's really bad for us. And he quit. I'm counting it. I'm counting it. I'm counting that as a 5-0. He quit because of how we played. We killed his MLRS. He didn't even see any Giga or anything. So that's good. 5-0 uh, there. So yeah, try try out the deck. Uh, if, you're, if you're bored on ladder, it, it's a good bit of fun. Nod units are always quite fun to play. Once you charge up the Giga, it's, it's very satisfying when it just melts everything in its path. If you did enjoy the video or you got any feedback, leave, them in the, leave your thoughts, comments in the comment section below. Uh, give the video a thumbs up and consider subscribing to the channel if you're not already subscribed. Thank you very much for watching and I'll see you in the next video.